I think I started about six six years ago. I started I started the summer going into eighth grade, so I want to say around six years ago now. Yeah, yeah. I never I never got lessons. I tried to get lessons once like a couple of years ago. It didn't work out for me. Just I, I was much better just teaching myself rather than you know getting from someone else. Um, my brother played. He got lessons from this guy, Chris Brazier. Chris Brazier, that's what it was. And um, he, he was getting like really good at it. I was like, wow, why can't I do that? I can definitely do that. So then um, I would take uh, the other guitar in the house and i just play that. And he would be learning all this cool new stuff and I'd still be like, how do I press my finger down without it hurting? <laughs> but yeah, and so basically, yeah, he's one of my role models, so I'd say. Definitely John Mayer, biggest biggest inspiration right there. But because um, he's like the first guitarist I actually started listening to, and other than like uh, Claudio Sanchez. Um, but uh, recently, in the past couple of years, I started like uh, coming into greater actual guitarists like Jimi Hendrix, Stevie Ray Vaughan, Eric Clapton, the real the real heroes out there, you know. Favorite song to play. Well, it depends. If I'm on, if I'm on acoustic, I want to say probably like something like Olivia by John Mayer because it's, it's, it's so cool. Yeah, he used the. I'd prefer probably being with a group because you have you have everyone backing you up and it's not like if you mess up everyone's got your back, you know? It's not like it's just you. Yeah, so like you are part of a band right now. Yeah, absolutely. I'd how'd say you, so. Uh, how'd you meet him? Uh well, the one is my roommate, the other guitarist, Joe. And then there's this kid, Brian, who plays drums. And then there's our other friend Joe who plays bass and he's Amazing, he's oh god, the greatest jazz player I've ever seen. Ever. I think like the transcendence into a different reality. It sounds very corny and very, very, very hippie. No, it's it's more like I'm in the music. I see it as an emotion and I'm portraying that for you guys rather than myself and telling you how I feel. I'm playing it. And I can really express it that way more than just speaking the words. I think it's like the only thing I have. Mm -hmm. I mean, other than like exercising, that's basically all I do. <laughs> like, I don't know. It it's really it really is a good outlet for my life, because people people deal with stress and they don't know how to handle it. And like, sure, I get I get upset over things and I want to like punch things, but I mean, I'd rather just like play guitar and get over it. It's it's a nice it's a nice thing to go to when you don't know what else to do.